so many times in so many ways I try to explain this amazing and super important point to my point of view about redemption about the hour of redemption about the great blessing the reward that we will enjoy in those uh, great hours of mind knowledge and uh, wisdom expansions I don't know what to say about it again but to reach that point again of understanding that what that our maker will do with us in that time will be so great he will take us to a place that will be unlimited into the limitations of time and place and we need to understand what it means it means that you won't be trapped anymore in your body and you won't be trapped anymore in the present time and any moment will be accessed for you and you'll be able to travel in all times and to travel does not mean as an individual just your awareness and your mind will expand to that place that you'll be able to experience that world that took place in that time zone and as well from the side of your place and your location you'll be able to go into the depths of any aspect any angle of creation and while doing that you'll be able to experience all the rest as well means that you'll be able to be in billions of different places and to experience them and also on those different time zones and especially those ones that are very related to who you are means that all your history all your legacy all the travels and the journey that your soul made since the early beginning when you were a part of the soul of Adam and Eve until today in all the lifetimes in all the bodies that you lived within like that I explained before that in the body of the parents before the mother was conceived your soul was a general spark included in the rest of the soul of your parents and before your parents came to this world your spark your soul was also inside your grandparents and your great-grandparents and on and on and when a child comes out to the world so the parents they just hand out a portion of their own soul and they transfer it to a new body and then over there it starts an individual experience of a soul treasured inside of a body but the soul's memory is ancient and does not have limits and does not stop in one body or another and is well attached from within with all history of its eternal existence just that forgetfulness fullness fell upon us and we do not remember who we really are in that aspect of our souls therefore you'll be able and you'll get a certain access a free access to all those moments that your soul traveled and not only as the soul itself also to understand the story that was surrounding you so you get access to other angles to other aspects as your heart will desire if you will want to travel and see the ocean in that place or the mountains of the desert or the journeys of the people of Israel or your tribe or your family or your ancestors you'll be able to access that knowledge because in that day the time of redemption the knowledge will cover the world like water covers the sea and as deep as your soul is the great water of wisdom 
will be revealed to you and you will just understand more and more and to depth to great greatness of understanding and like I said before not only in time also in the physical place of your existence you'll be able to experience many angles of the world in the same time the limitation of the individuality that we are trapped under the system of time and system of physicality of our body that is blocking and treasuring our ability into its own cells will expire and will be able to be way above that and way beyond that and the greatest thing of them all is not that we will just get an access to knowledge when we will reach and enjoy and see each and every one of those moments we will see it in its great time of redemption because when the redemption will start will begin it won't be just a redemption for us it be it's going to be the redemption of the whole wide world and all the worlds means that the freedom that will be seen to our generation that will be the generation that brought the redemption will flow over when we will set free from our cables from our limitations to be able to access all those angles sides and aspects of the existence since the first moment of creation in that wave of expansion also the redemption will expand and also the redemption will take place in all those places means that any moment that ever took place in the creation's history shall be redeemed because in any moment we are standing in front of our maker and every moment of our life is an eternal moment a certain angle of existence of his own reflection towards earth towards our creation and our creation is reflecting his greatness and it's breaking it into moments in our mind because our mind is limited to grasp the reflection in portions in parts but in reality there is no time at all and the place is unlimited as well and all the history and all what that ever took place is eternally taking place with no stoppings with no blockings with no limitations at all and therefore when we will experience the light and the illumination of the redemption we will experience it in its greatness and in the highest and most blessed moment of the kindness of our maker goodness expression in its heights in its greatness means that the highest kindness and grace of Hashem of our maker will be seen and we will experience that means that in all your travels in all your journeys in all those moments that you will be able to see Hashem you will see Hashem in his kindness you will see Hashem in his glory in his beauty you will not see the judgments and the challenges and the difficulties that we are experiencing today and that we experienced as different souls in the past in different bodies in the past we will just experience the same places just in their great moment of awakeness of resurrection of redemption on the tip of the fork it was about the redemption that is soon to come Thank you.